Hello world, Lisa Fredrickson, your friend and computer science professor with another short screencast about access. And this time we're going to talk about an error message that looks like this, a data type mismatch. When you see that error message, what it's saying to you is the criteria you are entering does not match the type of data that is in the field that you're trying to apply the criteria to. So in this case, I'm trying to find the products with a unit price of one, but I've entered the one as a string or text, yet the unit price field is a number field. So typically with number fields, we use a operator such as greater than or less than anyway, because typically we're not querying for an exact unit price. We could, but typically we are querying for above or below a particular threshold. So when I use five or greater than five in the unit price, and I don't get the type mismatch. If I go to the added on field, which is a date time field, and enter a string, I'm also going to get the same data type mismatch in criteria expression. The added on field wants date criteria. So lots of times we'll have date criteria that also uses a greater than or less than symbol because we're trying to find dates before or after a particular date. Access is great about adding the necessary syntax that's needed to make that criteria expression correct. Notice that it added these pound signs automatically around the date when I entered a proper date. And if I go to a text field and I enter in a string and click away, it will automatically add the quotation marks around the criteria. So you Typically, do not have to type either the pound signs or the quotation marks when entering criteria into the query grid in Access, although it's obviously important to know why that appears. Now, the product ID field is a auto number field, so when I enter the criteria 5, I see no particular delimiters, no pound signs or quotation marks around numeric criteria, and I am not getting a type mismatch. However, if I enter in ABC, which would obviously be a string, quotation marks were added, I'm going to get the data type mismatch in the criteria expression because the product ID field only holds numbers. Thank you.